Hello, it is Jubilee, and I'm back with another video. <laughs> and I'm doing the get to know you <laughs> tag. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. Um, yeah, because Liberty Whispers did it, and he tagged everyone who watched, so. I guess that means me. Yeah. So I'm just gonna get started. Okay. Name. My name is Jubilee. My full name is Jubilation Lee. <laughs> Nicknames. Like in the community or in real life? Um. Well, in the community, I have many nicknames. <laughs> And a lot of them are really annoying, and I don't like them, guys. Jubes is okay. Juby Jubes is annoying. <laughs> Goose is okay. Girl is not okay. Um, in real life, I don't have any nicknames. <laughs> Although, when I was younger, for some reason, my dad called me Mo. Which isn't the most feminine thing in the world. I don't even know why he called me that. We're not really sure. It has nothing to do with, like, my name or anything. So it's just weird. My birthday. Oh. <laughs> well, anyone who knows me knows I have this thing against birthdays and age and everything. But I don't mind sharing it with you. So my birthday's in five days. Um, January 18th. Mmm, computer. <sighs> Place of birth. I was born in Florida, in the U.S. Born and raised, um, uh, in the, the biggest city population-wise. I think it's... No, I mean area... anymore. Okay, it's the largest city in Florida on population, and it's the largest city by area in the U.S. Okay, so I mean, you can quickly Google that and figure out what that is. Um, one second. sign? No, oh, I have no idea. I don't do that. Apologies, I don't know. <laughs> Occupation, uh, student, and dance teacher, I guess? I don't get paid to teach dance, but I do that. So it's kind of like an occupation. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a mom to my dog. I raise her, so that's like a full-time job. She's so sweet though. And she just made a weird noise. <laughs> um, okay, parents. Hair color. My hair color is a very, 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 very dark brown. And everyone thinks it's black. But it's not black. I swear, guys. <laughs> and... Okay, sorry, people. Hold on. <laughs> Yep, I gotta edit that out. Okay. Um, but everyone used to argue with me, or they still do, about my hair color. And they're like, it's black. And I'm like, no, guys, it's brown. I think I would know. <laughs> it's just darn frustrating. Anyway. Hair length? Um, right now, it's like to my shoulders. Sort of. I don't know, just look at one of my other videos where I show my face or something. Eye color is a darkish brown, muddy 
boring brown color. Best feature. I don't know. Um. I don't know. People. <laughs> sounds bad. People always tell me I have nice legs. <laughs> yeah. Um, like I have long dancer looking legs and my dance teachers used to say they were living vicariously through me because <laughs> I always had the longest legs and I was the tallest. Anyway, I guess my legs <laughs> sound dumb. Um, <coughs> braces. Yeah, I use braces. I'm at my grandmother's house because I don't have Wi-Fi, but she does. Um, and her dogs are really yappy and they're annoying. My dog is asleep. She's so good. Uh, yeah, I used to wear braces when I was little because I actually, I was the first person out of everyone I knew to get braces. I got them in, um, like the fifth grade when I was like nine or something. I don't know what that is in like UK terms, sorry. And I still wear a retainer. I've worn it for years. It's been like a decade of wearing it. I don't know. That doesn't mean I'm 19. I will never tell you how old I am. Piercings. Uh, my ears are pierced. That's it. Just once. Tattoos. I don't have any and I don't want any. I just don't like the thought of something so permanent being on me. I think they're a nice way to express yourself, but it's just too permanent for me. Righty or lefty? Okay, well, this is weird, but I am right-handed, but I often prefer my left hand, so I'm not ambidextrous, but I often favor the left side of my body because of the fact that in dance, sorry, everything has to do with dance with me. In dance, I am a lefty. Um, I could do a left split before my right split. I can kick higher on my left side. I can foote or second, if you know what that is, on the left. Only on the left, and I can't do it on the right. So in dance, I'm a lefty, which is really not a good thing. But in rhyming, I'm a righty. So, but because of that, my left, like, calf is, like, more developed. I don't know. I'm not, like, that lopsided, but it's so noisy over here. Um, so sort of both. First, first best friend. I think my first best friend was a girl named Alicia. I actually had several friends named Alicia. And I currently have one, and her name is Alicia. Songbird whispers. Hi. <laughs> um, first chord was probably for dance. Again, I'm dragging dance in this again. Yeah, it's probably a dance competition that I went to. I got gold, which sounds nice, but it wasn't. Because in dance competitions, it's like silver, gold, high gold, platinum. But I was like 11. And I worked my way up. First sport? I've never played sports in my life. No, never. Never had never played sports. First real holiday. What does that mean? Aren't they all real holidays? <laughs> My first real holiday would probably have been Easter or something. <laughs> like when I was born. <laughs> I don't, does that mean like going somewhere and celebrating it? Because I've always just stayed home to celebrate Christmas and stuff. I don't know what that means, sorry. Other people have said, like, going places, but I've never been anywhere. Because I've never seen snow, guys. Never. Send it to me. First concert. I've never been to a concert. Like, not a real concert. Favorite film. Probably Star Wars. In case you haven't been able to tell by now, I really, really, really like Star Wars. Like, a lot. And I watch it a lot. <laughs> like, twice a month. 
you have to watch all of them with well, the original trilogy. Um, so that's one of them. Favorite TV show is probably The Big Bang Theory. Um, favorite color is gray, which is a terrible first color, I'm aware of that, but I like it. But I also like, um, purple and black and blue, which all seem like really depressing colors, so sorry. Favorite restaurant? I, I don't have a favorite restaurant. Um, sorry, there's this, like, comforter that my mic's sitting on, it's very fun to scratch. <laughs> I don't know, uh, I don't have a favorite restaurant, because I don't eat out very much. Favorite store? Well, I don't actually like shopping <laughs> whatsoever. I actually have this sort of fear of shopping, and you think I'm kidding, but you can ask my mother, and I'm not. <laughs> She knows not to take me shopping because I will just be the most obnoxious person ever. I don't want to try things on, I don't want to look at the clothes, I just want to go to the boys section and find some sort of nerdy shirt and just get that and I'm good. And I just want to go after that. I don't want to shop around so I don't have a favorite store. Like, like that. But if, but I like other stores that have non-clothes. Like, with electronics and stuff. <laughs> Maybe a comic book store. Did there aren't any around here. Favorite book? <sighs> Sometimes I really hate these favorite questions, because I don't have a favorite book. There are just too many. I, I love Harry Potter. I love this, that series very much. I like the book Little Women. I love Lisa May Alcott. Those are some of my favorites, but I have a lot more and I can't even remember all that I love. I like the Maze Runner trilogy. For some reason that always pops in my head. It's not like my favorite, but I think it's good. And the Hunger Games is good. <laughs> favorite magazine? I'm not subscribed to any magazines. I used to be subscribed to several dance magazines when I was younger and actually dancing and not teaching. Um, so I have some of my mother gets like those entertainment TV ones, so sometimes I'll see like Frodo on the cover or something, so I steal it and I read all about whatever geeky thing it is, but that's not very often. So, probably a dance magazine. <sighs> shoes? Favorite shoes? Oh, okay. Well, if you know me in real life, you basically can't catch me without Converse, because I'm always wearing Converse. Um, I have black Converse and gray Converse, they're my favorite. I wear the black ones all the time, and they're really beat up looking. But yeah, Converse, oh, but then since I'm a Floridian, we always wear flip-flops, so I wear flip-flops a lot too. Sandals, whatever. Currently feeling. I'm currently feeling, I was feeling really, um, sort of depressed and anxious this morning because of things I had to do that I'm seeing, I'm almost like having a panic attack just thinking about it, but, um, but then I started talking to all these random people that I'm friends with and <laughs> that put me in a better mood. So I'm currently feeling, <laughs> sorry, okay, I'm feeling okay. Currently single or taken? I'm currently, um, single. Currently eating? I'm not eating anything. So, nothing. <laughs> currently listening to? I'm not listening to anything. But I'm... The last thing I was listening to was... Um... Death Cab, I think, in the car. What song was it? I think I was listening to, yeah, Transatlanticism. Mm-hmm.
currently thinking about. I'm thinking about what I'm going to answer these questions. <laughs> um, yep, that's all. Just thinking about this tag I'm currently wearing. Ooh, okay, I really like what I'm wearing right now. I'm quite proud of it. I got this shirt for my birthday as I went to Disney because I like Disney a lot. I'm a Floridian. And I went to Epcot and if you know what that is, they have in the back all these different countries. So I liked the UK over there. It's very fun. I don't think that's what the UK really looks like, but I wouldn't know. Um, but anyway, they had a lot of cool stores and I saw this one shirt and I was just I freaked out when I saw it and I think the cashier was a little afraid of me but my mother said oh I'm gonna buy you that for your birthday and I basically have not taken it off since I got it which sounds terrible but it's a, a blue shirt and it's a very unique shade of blue and it, it says Keep calm and don't blink. And it has a little police box on the top. <laughs> yep. And so when I, as I walked around, just excited to go put it on immediately. Um, I got some, yeah, awesome shirts, you know. And so I, I like shirts like this. That sort of reference something subtly. So that way, if there are other people like me who like it. We could form like an instant bond, you know? <laughs> but needless to say, people where I live don't get it. If you get it though, that's awesome. But yeah, I'm wearing that in jeans. Uh, future want children. <clears throat> um, I didn't before, but I think I do now. I don't know. Maybe one. Like, I think it would have to be just one nice child <laughs> and a boy. I want a boy for some reason. I think girls are a little high maintenance. I don't think I would be able to handle them. So maybe one boy. Um, want to be married? Not particularly. Not really. Um, because I think I can do the single mom thing by myself. <laughs> I'm a very independent person. Um, but, I don't know, maybe. Um, careers in mind. I don't really want to say because... I guess I change my mind all the time and it's terrible. I mean, I know the general direction of what I want to do. But I'm not. It's changed a lot. I wanted to be a vet when I was little. And then I wanted to be on Broadway for the longest time, and I didn't stop. What was that? Oh, that's weird. And then I and I changed my mind not that long ago. So, and yeah, it's kind of constantly evolving. Um, where do you want to live? I don't want to live in Florida for sure. Especially not this town. I hate this town, and I want to get out. I would like to live I would I would like to live out, out of the US really. Um I would like to live in Europe. Like the UK. I think New Zealand's very pretty too. I'd like to live there. Um or Taiwan maybe. I'm not sure I wanna live in China, but, but Taiwan would be fun. Do you believe in God? Um, yes. I am a Christian, but a weird Christian. Because my beliefs are, um, they're not typical Christian thing. I'm a Presbyterian, if you know what that is. Like, so we don't really believe in things it says in the Bible, because we're very literal. Um, like, we don't literally believe that the earth was created in, in seven days and stuff. So, and we don't like, no offense if you, if you do this, but we don't, like, put our hands in the air and say hallelujah and stuff. We're very quiet. Um, 
So I have been dying with recent events. This is taking a really long time. I guess it's okay. After. Anyway, do you believe in miracles? No, not really. I'm a um, very real realistic person. So I just consider it a nice coincidence or you know, something like that. I, it's, it, you know, it's not a miracle. It's nice to believe in miracles, but I'm not that childish. <laughs> Sorry, that's my fault. Do you believe in love at first sight? No, I don't even believe in love at all. I think that love at first sight is just dumb. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, you see someone that is attractive, you're going to be physically attracted to them. You're not gonna fall in love with them, that's just dumb. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm sorry if you believe in that and you don't like my beliefs, but I'll still support yours. But I don't, and I don't believe in love. And don't get me started on that because I'll argue with you about that all day. Do you believe in ghosts? Not really. My parents. Like are, no sorry, not ghosts so much. My parents are very obsessed with aliens. They're always watching these alien shows, and I just think they're weird. But <laughs> what can I do? So ghosts, no. Aliens, no. Well, I don't know. I've watched so many of these now that I'm not sure. I think there's a lot of weird stuff, but I'm not sure that I believe. I don't know. So, I don't think there are aliens. <laughs> anyway, do you believe in soulmates? No. I think that there are people who are very similar to each other. Maybe even almost perfectly similar. Not absolutely 100%, but like close. But soulmates just sounds weird. <laughs> do you believe in heaven and hell? Um, yes, in a sense. I'm not sure. I'm still thinking about everything. So I really like. Uh, I'm a big. I'm a big fan of mythology, uh, Greek mythology, Egyptian mythology, Roman, Norse, and I like a lot of their opinions on and beliefs. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that's my pack. Do you believe in kissing on the first date? I don't know. I've never even been on a date. No. I think that... No. <laughs> it's just too much display of emotion. Do you believe in yourself? Yes, of course I do. Oh my goodness. Because if I don't believe in myself, who is, you know? I believe it's nice to be, or you have to be very self-confident in yourself. It, but I, oh, which is funny, because I, <sighs> that's it. Uh, I, I used to have no confidence in myself, and I was really shy, and I'm still very, very, very introverted, but I've really worked on ways to overcome that. Um, it was tough, but, um, one thing that really helped me was taking acting lessons, and, um, my mom was an actor, so I sort of grew up doing that, but it didn't. I was still really shy, especially as a kid. I never wanted to play with other kids or socialize, or I just wanted to stay home with my mom <laughs> and read. Uh, but acting helped me sort of um, open up. And so now I'm the weird person that I am today. And that's the end of the tag. And, and I can't think of anyone in specific tag, because I'm not positive who all has done it or not, so I think I'm going to just pull Liberty Whispers here and say, you're all tagged. <laughs> I, I hate when people say that, because it's dumb, you're not really tagging anyone, but if you feel like doing it, just do it. This has been really long, and it's just me rambling on. It's not relaxing whatsoever, right? Maybe if you 
turn it down and I don't know, just be like white noise of me tabling on incessantly about nonsensical things and now I'm gonna stop. <laughs> I promise to put some better videos out soon. Like, I will get around to doing that <coughs> Chinese lesson roleplay thingy. So I will do that. And... <laughs>